My name is Alicia Finch, and this is my 4.1 reflection for concepts in photography. I chose to pursue the style of American portrait photographer Annie Leibovitz and her approach of personal reporting, or capturing the rawness and relatability of her clients, uh, a natural, relaxed truth. So I stepped up to the challenge of a self-portrait as a way to explore my own personality disorder as well as challenge the misconceptions stigmatized by living with a mental illness. I sought to brainstorm words I would describe myself as, exploring positive and negative labels, and I compiled them together on a canvas that I would use as a prop during my shoot. At that point, my self-consciousness kicked in, and to settle my nerves, I had planned ahead and set up snacks and soft blankets and different things to help ground me and calm me down. Periodically, throughout the shoot, I needed to unwind in this way, and eventually I fell into a flow. After going through the shots, I landed with a handful of potentials, and at that point, I went back to reference Annie's work, uh, the high sensitivity, the deep contrast, primarily her black and white portraits. I knew the most important factor I needed, needed to bring forth was the raw personality, so I picked a few of my shots to bring into Photoshop to touch up, and... In the end, I, I am very proud of what I was able to accomplish from pushing through something I felt very uncomfortable doing all the way to the end result. And I now very much appreciate the value of a solid pre-plan because I know as well as anyone that anything can happen and it is always best to be prepared. So going into this project with a clear idea helped me to stay focused and to plan well. Throughout this class, we've all explored many new names and techniques, uh, several new areas for inspiration, and I know I personally have been working on a project of taking at least one photo each day so far this year and posting it on my Instagram, and the inspiration and lessons we've learned here have been invaluable to me, and um, I will continue to explore interesting ways to capture a photograph moving forward. Uh, thank you all very much, and I wish you all the best of luck.